Hello, and welcome to the April monthly update for Utilico Emerging Markets. I'm Jacqueline Brewers, Deputy Portfolio Manager. This month, UEM's NAV total return decreased marginally by 0.1%, underperforming the MSCI Emerging Markets Index, which was up 1.4% in sterling terms. Global markets were mixed in April, with the US market grappling with stronger than expected March inflationary data that indicated that inflation continues to be stickier than hoped. As a result, the S&P index was down by 4.2% for the month. Within emerging markets, there were some outperformers. The Turkish index was up by 9.9% as the market is now expecting headline interest rates to peak in May at 75%. Argentina also followed suit with the index up 9.1% as investor sentiment significantly improved amid structural economic reforms led by Javier Millet, the recently elected president. China was also more positive with the Hong Kong Hang Seng Index and Chinese Shanghai Index increasing by 7.4% and 2.1% respectively, helped by the better than expected first quarter GDP result of 5.3%, indicating that growth is on track to meet this year's government's target of 5%. And India was up 1.2% for the month as the country's general election started. However, Vietnam was disappointingly down 5.8% in April, as the expectation of higher for longer US interest rates continues to put pressure on the Vietnamese dong. And Brazil was also weaker, with the market down 1.7%, as potential delays in US rate cuts resulted in a repricing of the yield curve. And the market was also affected by the perceived increase in fiscal risk caused by the government's decision to revise its 2025 to 2026 fiscal targets. There were no changes to UEM's top 30 during the month. UEM, however, continues to see a number of its investee companies report strong financial results. TAV share price was up by 23.6%, benefiting from its first quarter 2024 results being stronger than expected with revenues up 27.8% and EBITDA increasing 96.8%. Manila Water's share price was also up by 10.7% as the market continues to see strong momentum following solid results reported in March. And Kunlun Energy's share price was also up 16.8%, resulting from the positive momentum witnessed in the Hong Kong market during the month. UEM's share price appreciated by 2.3% this month with a discount to NAV narrowing to 17.5%. UEM continued to buy back shares during the month. For more details, please do read UEM's April fact sheet.